Hi everyone and happy Thanksgiving. I have a timely question for you. Are you a thanks feeler or a thanksgiver? That's a question my friend Tim Lundy asks. Now, what do I mean by that? Well, in Luke chapter 17, as Mark Spurlock taught us this past weekend, there's that great story about the 10 people with leprosy that Jesus heals. And only one of them, when he sees that he's healed, comes back and gives thanks. Verse 15 says he came praising God in a loud voice. And the Greek term translated loud voice is megaphonos, from which we get our English word megaphone. In other words, he didn't just whisper, Psst, hey, Jesus, come over here. Listen, I just want to say thanks, man, for what you did to me back there. That was, that was super special. No, he yelled it out so the world could hear, look, everybody, I'm healed. He gave thanks very publicly. And in verse 19, Jesus says, rise, your faith has made you well. And that means more than just healed him of leprosy. It made him whole. At every level, he was brought into abundant life. And indeed, studies show that Thankfulness leads to higher levels of happiness, less depression, less anxiety, more success at work, less pain physically. But of course, that story is not just about the power of thankfulness. It's also about the rarity of real thanksgiving. See, I bet every one of those 10 healed of leprosy were thankful. They were probably all, this is awesome, so glad they felt thanks. They were thanks feelers, but there was only one thanks giver who returned to give thanks. And that brings me back to my opening question. Are you a thanks feeler or a thanks giver? Probably this time of year, a lot of us feel thankful, right? We feel grateful for our friends, for our salvation. But the problem is we live in a world that helps us just express negative things all the time. But the Bible says in 1 Thessalonians that always giving thanks, not just feeling thanks, is God's will for you. So I tell you what, right now, just take 15 seconds to think of what you feel grateful for. Ready? What do you feel grateful for? 15 seconds, go. Okay, now that you are a thanks feeler, go be a thanksgiver. Go to that family member, that friend of the Lord for whom you felt gratitude just now and use that megaphonos. Publicly tell them thanks. You'll make your Thanksgiving better and theirs too. Hey, one more thing. A couple of people have asked me, is it too late to donate to the food drive? Of course not. You still have a chance to give at tlc.org slash food. Hey, listen, thanks for joining me on this special day. God bless you. Happy Thanksgiving. Not just thanks feeling.